Let me show you how easy it is to add CPU and memory resources to your existing VMware VMs. Let's go. First, let's take a look at our VMware Ansible collections and select VMware Ops. The VMware Ops collection includes a variety of Ansible roles and playbooks you'll want to use to manage your VMware environments. Here you can see where you can access the Git repository as well as the different roles in how to manage your VMware VMs such as provision VM, system settings, cluster settings, and many more. Our focus today is on the provision VM role so that we can make it super easy to hot add new resources to our VMs whenever we need them. Switching to the vSphere client, we see I have a VMware Explorer folder and one demo VM to showcase the updating of resources. By selecting the demo VM, we can see it's VM hardware resources that include one CPU and two gigs of memory. And within our Ansible Automation Platform template section, I have a hot add CPU and memory job template that will allow me to modify those VMs as I need, taking advantage of the hot add VM playbook I created and filling out a simple survey providing name, memory, and the amount of CPUs I want to add for each. Now all I have to do to modify the VM is simply launch it. Now what exactly is in that hot add VM playbook that allowed me to do this? By taking advantage of that provision VM role, all I need to do is specify my variable values and just like that I can modify as many VMs as I need. With that job now running, we wait for the completion of the job and then we can switch to the vSphere client and see that the newly updated demo VM is up and running with its now 4 CPU and 6 gigs of memory. And just like that, we've automated the process of hot adding resources to your virtual machines.